Hello guys, um, on a, for today, let's talk about a uh, war binding machine. What to consider um, in binding this machine and what to expect. Okay, um, what are the products that can be uh, produced using this machine also? Because, la, uh, dami kasi na ano, na, na, ano, ano tawag doon, na, uh, na mali ng bili ng machine. Um, instead of buying wire binding machine, they bought the combining machine, which is kanito. Tingnan nyo yung, ano, naka rectangle yung, ano, dyan dito. Ito yung, ano, um, combining machine. And for the wire binding machine, guys, you can see the squares here. Um, this re represents the, ano, uh, the butas. <laughs> Yan. Okay. In, buy in, why in buying um, this machine, we have to consider the pitch. Pitch is um, yung butas niya in 1 inch. We have 3 is to 1 and 2 is to 1 pitch. So, ano ba yung 3 is to 1 and ano yung 2 is to 1? I have here um, 3 is to 1 pitch since I am using this one and this is the common pitch um, in every project I make like um, the notebooks, calendars, um, notepads, ganyan. So, ayan. Let's check para ma, ano nyo ma imagine. So, this is the 1 inch. Ayan. 1 inch. Then, in 1 inch, there is 3 holes. Kaya, ayan. 1, 2, 3. Yeah, 3 is to 1 ang um, pitch niya. So, ayan. And this ring is, ano to, 12.9, I think. The wire is 12.9. And this one is 7.9. I use 7.9 sa, ano, sa desktop calendars, um, notebooks na my 30 pages, ganyan. And then, for this one, I use 12.9 sa ano, sa mga customized notebook na 80 pages, my, kung ano din, my sketch pad, um, notepads, ganyan. So, okay, um, ayun, my 3 is to 1 and 2 is to 1 I consider for the pitch. And for the machine, I buy this brand, Quaff. Um, naka dalawang machine ako guys yung isa kasi nabili ko na murang mura lang I think that was 1.8 to 2k ata then after 100 projects like 100 pieces calendar last year um, ayun nasira na siya so hindi po siya advisable na pang ano pang mass production or pang matagalan talaga so I bought this one and then so far this is so good kasi my ano siya dito adjustment adjustment for the pitches i yeah for the pitches for the holes yan dito kapag gusto niyo for example ito yung paper that lagay, lagay niyo diyan pag gusto niyo na walang butas dito i-pull niyo lang tong pin tapos ito basta ma ano mo siya mako-customize mo siya so ayan and then for the, ano, diba, dalawang, ano to, dalawang uh, sizes, this is 12.9 and this is 7.9, so, for this machine, dito tayo mag adjust sa banda dito, guys, makikita nyo dyan na, ano, na may iba't ibang sizes dyan, na i-roll nyo lang kung ano yung preferred sizes nyo, kita nyo yan, may 7.9 to 14.3 to 15.9, si, um, kanyan. So, dyan yun yung adjust dyan. Then, ito, this one, adjustment po ito para dito. Uh, yung space dito, kung gusto nyo siyang uh, more, more space here, so, i-adjust nyo ito, i-pull, i-pull nyo ito, or i-push, kanyan. So, dalaw dalawang, ano lang, dalawang adjustment, ganitong, ganitong distance, tapos may isa pa na, yung parang ano yung medyo maliit na space na lang yan so for example uh, for this one 7.9 
require let's set the machine to 7.9 here and then for example nag ano na tayo nagbabind na tayo so ilagay natin dyan ilagay natin dito yung wire yan then for binding we have to put this one here oh, ganito ganyan pabandang ganyan tingnan nyo nakatayo siya and then for the holder dalawa kasi yan may mataas tsaka yung shorter one so we have to pull this one the shorter one this is for the upper side ayan kapag nag ano na yan nagpa flat yung wire dyan um okay flat natin to this is for the 7.9 Teka guys, namali ako. Yan. This is for the 7.9. So, ayun. Tingnan. Na, na, na siya. Nabind na natin siya. For the 7.9. Ayan, ganyan. So, ganun din ang gagawin natin sa 12.7 I think. Oh yes, 12.7. We have to set the 12.7 here para ano, para ma masakto yung pagkaka-bind niya dito, according sa size ng wire niya. So, ayun. Um, and also, don't forget, um, when binding, guys, we have to punch only 15 sheets, and then the maxim maximum binding length is only A4. Pero kapag meron kayong long size, um, I think magagawa din naman natin yan ng paraan kasi movable naman ito. Ayan. Pwede niyo naman sigurong tanggalin or ano. I think, uh, pwede naman lagpas yung paper. <laughs> so, para-paraan na lang. Ayan. So, this is for the A4 size. And then, for this one here, we can bind until 130 sheets dito. So, I bought this one, I think, um, around 4 to 5k sa so Shopee lang din um, I advise na ganitong brand ang bibilhin since talagang heavy duty po siya hindi po kayo ligi dito kesa dun sa cheaper price pero hindi pang matagalan guys so, so ayun guys um, instead of buying um, cheaper machine it's better to ano na lang, invest um, a heavy duty machine para hindi tayo paulit ulit na um, bili ng bili ng machine um, para isahan na lang guys hindi naman tayo lugi dito um, promise um, when December comes marami pa talagang order especially sa planners and then sa calendars so I advise na kapag bibili kayo ng machine um, diretsyo na lang sa heavy duty and then ano iwasan na lang yung mura kasi what can you expect naman for mura diba so, um, I'm not discriminating or ano na because it's based on my ano naman in ex experience guys so ayun so please don't forget um, the things to consider when buying war, war binding machine um, number one is the pitch here the number of holes ayan 3 is to 1 or 2 is to 1 um, yeah and also, when I'm choosing a uh, machine, guys, uh, please check these holes here. It's square. It's not re rectangle, same this one. Okay. And then, I think, um, yun na yun. Kasi, nung ako, nung bumili din ako sa ganitong machine, na, kept confused din ako. Ano ba yung pitch? Um, ano ba yung 2 is to 1? Ano ba yung 3 is to 1? Uh, okay. <laughs> so, ayun. Ngayon, alam nyo na. So, you know which machines to buy. And... Ayan, more more projects to come yung sa atin. and then I hope you'll um, subscribe and please like my video if there is um, questions or any anything clarifications uh, suggestions or if you want tutorials for for binding then please comment on the comment section so that I can make another vlog um, and also guys to help you um, based on my knowledge. <laughs> um, kasi lahat ng to based on experience lang din. So, ayun, sige. So, until next time, see you, bye!